that whole process really um, inspired the work, one of the works that I donated to the Cambridge Moss Project um, because it was through that understanding of colour that my um, my process became a lot more intuitive and I felt that I didn't have to look at flowers anymore for inspiration but um, I started painting with the colours that were within me and that um, piece of artwork is actually called Heart in Bloom which I think um, reflects that, that process very well because it was no longer looking, it was no longer about looking outside for inspiration but it became an internal thing where um, the, I felt that the colours were um, a part of me and I was then able to express that in a more intuitive way. When I was a student doing my Masters at the Princess School, uh, we had geometry classes which ran throughout the two years of the course. Um, and in, in um, practicing geometry, um, I became interested in, in geometry and nature, and also, um, in particular, geometry of the flowers, and also the color of the flowers, and how in nature, um, color is all, the color harmony is always perfect. Um, and I wanted to see if I could achieve that in my painting and maybe if through studying flowers and geometry I could learn something about um, how colour works in painting as well. Um, so for about a year I kept a sketchbook where I would photograph flowers and then use the colours of those flowers in my geometrical paintings too. Um, and I learned so much about colour through, through keeping that sketchbook. Um, at the end of the year I, I felt as though I didn't need to be looking at the flowers anymore for inspiration um, and my work, my geometry work and my, the colour that I used in my geometry became a lot more intuitive. So one of the pieces that I've donated is a geometric painting. It's, um, and it, it is actually one of, the, um, one of the first pieces I painted where I wasn't looking at the, um, the, looking at the colour from the flowers directly. It was more of an intuitive decision to use those colours, but based upon um, based upon the um, what I what I'd learnt from studying the flowers in the geometry.